大家好，欢迎来到我的频道，这是你的男孩胜利者，有免费 extra， 另一个新品来到你，而新年快乐。Oh, Chinese is difficult. Okay, so in today's video, we're gonna be talking about things I wanna focus on this year. Not really like a resolution list, like like everybody does that. So let's call this video things I want to focus on this year. So, without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, so the first one on my list is school. I think I need to do better than I did last year. I think I can really study more. Not like I did bad or anything, but I think I just need to like improve. On my studies, cause there's this stereotype like school in China is way easier than like back home. I think okay, it's not really a stereotype. I think it is true because there are some subjects that like way easier than back home. So I think when people come with that mindset, they come relaxed. I myself am、um, subject to that. I came so relaxed, like studying wasn't even on my mind. It was just more like play, play, play. And no studying, so yeah, I really need to study more this year. So if you are coming to China, make sure don't come with that mindset that no school is easy. You just just walk over and you just psh, no study, study, study. Okay, so the second thing on my list is socializing. Oh my god, I think I need to be more social this year. Ah, it's weird, like how I don't have that many friends because I'm like usually on social media. Like usually checking feeds, uploading photos, you know, liking, reposting, tweeting, retweeting, you know the shiz. But like, yeah, my social pool is really small, which I have no problem with. Like it's really good to have like a close number of friends. But like I need to be more social. Like when I go out, I think I'm really like closed in. Like I really don't know how to talk to people that much. Even though people are like, no, you have a YouTube channel. You're like one of the most social people I know, and I'm like. I'm like so not social. I'm like an introvert and stuff. So yeah, I can probably work on that. So I don't know. The next thing I need to work focus on rather is my dancing. Yeah, this is one hella topic because like I've been dancing since I was young. But like the type of dancing I used to do when I was when I was young is different from the type of dancing I'm into right now. So I need to focus and practice on that because, like, my dancing in the past few years has been very rocky and periodic. You know, I've been having like long time hiatuses, hiatus, hiatuses. I don't know what the plural is for hiatus, but yeah, I've been having a lot of hiatuses. Yes, we'll go with that. Yeah, I really need to focus on my dancing because, like, last year I would be like. One month, I would be so into it. I would be dancing, practicing each and every day. Okay, not every day, but like more often than the next month. For like maybe like for the next three months, I would be like sleeping, eating, and sleeping, eating, and eating, and sleeping. Yeah. So I really need to focus on that、the、type of dance I'm into right now is like hip hop and like these modern street dances and stuff. So like, I don't know. I'm also getting into Afro a bit because like that's becoming really popular. Yeah, I'll probably also get on that train.、Mm -hmm. I think there are even like dance studios in this city, so maybe I'll try to visit some. Maybe attend a few classes. Maybe that will also. Like motivate me to do more or better in my dancing. Yeah, I can really focus on that more. And maybe if I like start doing better, I'll start releasing more and more dance videos on my YouTube channel. I have been working on like a few pieces, a few routines. I've been trying to like conjure up and stuff. So maybe, hopefully, this year I will be dropping a few dance videos. Watch out for those and share, subscribe, and like. So yeah. Okay. So the fourth thing on my list is my Chinese. I used to. At the beginning of the video, it's kind of shaky, but I think I'm doing good for a first year. Or I'm going to my second year this year. But yeah, Chinese is 
particularly not a hard subject or language rather it's just like the interest you have in it so like my current level i think at least i can do like can get by in china quite well without a translator I can make some small talk not really like conversational yeah i'm not up to that level yet but hopefully maybe this year i'll try to get to that level like the level where i can start like full conversations because right now maybe just going to stores like you know just that small talk level yeah that's where i'm at right now Hopefully this year I'll focus on learning more and more Chinese. Maybe I can like go out in the streets and interact with Chinese people, try to talk to them more. I think that really helps with like broadening your vocabulary in a language. If you want to learn a new language, that can really help. Maybe I'll try to bring some in my in my videos. Who knows? I'll collaborate with some of them. So we'll see what this year brings. Yeah, I should really focus on reading and writing more because like I know a few strokes, not those strokes here because like you have to learn all the different kind of strokes and it's it's really hard work i need to focus on like on my reading and writing chinese characters i can read a few characters but writing uh, i think reading is way easier than writing because like first you have to learn how to read then you learn how to write right is that how it works I don't know but yeah I need to broaden my characters and there are 6,000 characters and I probably know like 30 something that's that's quite good for my level I think I can read a few sentences what I usually do is like when I'm in the streets with my friends and I'll be looking at billboards and posters and I'll be trying to see like which characters I know and try to read them and my friends will be like what are you doing and I'm like I'm learning nice so yeah I'll try to do that more Maybe like use my translator, uh, learn more, try to study more, I guess. Next on my list is fitness. I think I can work out more than I did last year. Cause last year I tried to go to the gym, but much more like my dancing to like on, off, on, off, on, off, like two months. I'll be going consecutively to the gym. Then three months later, I'll just be sleeping and eating and I'll gain back weight that I lost in those two months. So maybe I can try like running, you know, doing some exercises, cardio. Yeah, I really need to focus on my fitness. You know, you gotta get in some exercise health is wealth <laughs> speaking of health that brings me to my next thing on my list that i need to focus on is my eating i need to focus more on my eating on my diet like i need to eat more healthy i guess because so like last year it was junk food after junk food after junk food after junk food yeah maybe i'll try to eat more healthy maybe more fruits more of a balanced diet and trying to reduce on the carbs on the junkies like pizza burgers fries fried chicken what am i talking about i'm gonna miss those but yeah because in like in china it's so easy to order food you just go on your phone beep, boop, ba, ba. 10 minutes later your pizza is right in front of you your, your burgers your soda your fried chicken so I need to start eating healthy guys and the last thing on my list that's obvious i guess is my youtube channel i really need to focus more maybe i can make like a schedule when i'll be releasing my videos if it's like two times or three times a week maybe i'll set the number of days but again some people like like random posts like yeah some people have liked like you no know, i like random posts maybe like every day and stuff but like since we're on holiday now i am on holiday for like a month so maybe i'll have more time to produce more videos but like when we reopen next semester, I probably won't have as much time as I have now. So I try to come up like with a set day which I'll be releasing my video so that you can know like, oh, it's Monday, Victor's releasing a video. Oh, it's Tuesday, Victor's releasing a video. Like, like that, yeah. Yeah, I think that's pretty much it for now. That's all I need to focus on this year. But yeah, I really need to do more. Like I really need to do better as a person, just like in general. I just hope like I'll be able to follow all these things. Maybe I'll make making reminders for everything and everything. So yeah, okay, that's pretty much it for today. So thank you for watching. Thank you for tuning in, for staying until the end of the video. Well, I hope I'll just be like able to follow all the things I set up today. Maybe like they'll push me and motivate me more to do and do better as a person. Hope you can do better as a person too. I think it's really good to have like a list of things that you need to focus on, you know, set your goals straight can really help you as a person grow as a person i've heard so like yeah i think this video will help me grow as a person this year 2020 i hope whenever i forget something i'll just come back to this video and be like oh these are the things i need to work on so yeah thank you for watching see you next time see you next time see you next time peace